Every year, we use an average of 500 billion to 1 trillion plastic bags. Every minute, over 1 million. To put this into perspective, if you were to tie each plastic bag from end to end, they would wrap around the Earth's equator 4,200 times. People don't realize how much of a threat plastics are to our world, and most importantly, to our oceans. When we throw plastic away, it's not like it miraculously disappears. It might not be your problem, but it becomes someone else's. The other day, I watched this documentary called A Plastic Tide. Look, look at this beautiful beach in Mumbai with no plastics to be seen. Well, this is what it looked like before the 95-week cleanup. With the help of over 1,000 volunteers and 5,000 tons of plastic removed, they were able to return this beach back to normality. <sighs> Without realizing it, every day we're surrounded by plastic and have basically become an essential component in our daily lives. Think for a minute. Imagine you've just woken up and you go to your bathroom and brush your teeth with your plastic toothbrush and plastic packaged toothpaste. You then walk downstairs and drink some water out of your plastic water bottle. It's only been five minutes into your morning and everything you've touched was made out of plastic. And so the day carries on with more and more. We have become so used to having it, we can't imagine a world without it. Plastics were a great invention. However, single-use plastics, well, not so much. Thing is, plastics have only really been around since the 1950s, and over half of all plastics ever manufactured have been made since the 2000s. Think about something you use every single day, like a plastic cup. You might use this for water, coffee, tea, etc. Now multiply that by a year. You would have used an average of 365 cups. Now, Let's multiply that by everyone here in the audience tonight. That would be 18,000 cups. Now, you see the problem has gone from one cup a day to 18,000 cups a year. But one cup a day didn't sound like a lot, but eliminating 18,000 cups a year does, right? Saying no to single-use plastic cups is one small step in the right direction, however, there are other small changes you can make in your daily life to help this problem. Start by saying no to single-use plastic bags. Seems like an easy task, right? Well, even though in Spain taxes have been added to our bags, we still use an average of 180 bags per person per year. This is equivalent to one bag for every two days. How difficult can it be to use a reusable bag? Countries such as France, Morocco, Rwanda, and Kenya have already said no to single-use plastic bags. So what are we waiting for? Many studies have found that by the year 2050, there will be more plastics in our oceans than there are fish. Might sound exaggerated, but it's the truth. Plastic production is increasing year by year and won't stop until we put an end to it. Now, I'm not here to say that you should become an environmentalist an eco-activist or start living a zero-waste lifestyle. Not even do I do that. I'm just here to warn you about the problems that single-use plastics are causing to our world and how small changes can make a big difference. So then, why wait for international agreements or laws to be installed to make a change? Do it for yourself and start today. Thank you.